Hello everyone, this is JNAM5 and today I'm going to show you how to upload a plugin on a Multicraft server host. Um, this is actually a pretty simple process of um, just getting the plugin into the server. So right away, what you want to do is just shut off the server. Stop. As soon as you see this X right here, you're good to start. And then what you want to do is go down to FTP file access. Once there, you want to put in your Multicraft password. Once you're in this area, what you want to do next is click plugins. When at plugins, you should see nothing if you have no plugins or um something if you have plugins such as world edit essentials or something of a jar file dot jar file now what you want to click is create the no file no directory create that direct no 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 uh create file when you when you create a file you want to name it plugins this takes a a minor space and um it just helps the process for me it's um zero bits so or whatever but yeah really though next what you want to do is want to look up bucket plugins dot org plugins dot bucket dot org once you're there you want to find a plugin that you like i'm going to go with a plugin called world edit this plugin helps you to basically just you know world edit stuff in it's a very simple process of getting no wooden um axe and just left clicking and right clicking and doing slash slash set whatever you want whatever the thing is okay now next thing you want to do is click upload now once it, once you're here <coughs> you see that there are two things here files to upload and archives to upload and unpack now, say it's in this .zip file right here, as you see. What you want to do, for the simple way, drag it onto here, and then next, open this up, and then choose file. Now, since it is a .zip file, choose file there. Next thing you want to go to is desktop wherever you placed it actually now you want to type in what the first word is world edit dot zip open and now you see it here now I'll display something else for you guys here today wait this is a dot jar file that's a dot zip file um um yeah I just don't want to add anything there but I'll add anyways now once you add that plugin you want to click the submit file once you click that submit file it should be unpacking everything and you should see this what you want to do then is click back if it doesn't say okay then you want to um, put it in the other file. But now, when you're in the plugin file, and I'll tell you I'm in the plugin file, plugins, you'll see all this stuff. Now, you see the world edit.jar. That's basically what runs the plugin. Now, what you want to do is go to servers and back to my server. Once there, you want to press start. To see if the plugin worked, the first thing to do, 
there's two things to do. What you want to do is um get into Minecraft. Once in Minecraft, log in. Now that you're in Minecraft, what you want to do is get into your server. For me, it is 64.79 point one oh seven point fourteen colon two five five three one then join server you should be joining your world and as you can see I joined my world here next thing you want to do is do a simple check and the simple check is to do slash plugins as you can see, world edit appears. And now, world edit is available for you. It's gonna. Okay. Now that world edit has been chosen, next thing you want to do is wait for it to unpack everything. This may take a few minutes or a few seconds depending on what your RAM is and how much is empty and how much is available for use. To to make the process faster, what we are going to do is we are going to slash we're going to slash help and um find out what the plugin is or what how to get rid of this rain as you can see we got slash slash which enables oh wait I'm not op <laughs> that's a good thing to happen on your server not being op anyways this will show you how to get op on your server what you want to do is go on straight into the console and type in op your name and then enter and then on your display screen it should say you are now op and now it should say now whenever you go in here it should say this now you can do everything with the plugins super pickaxe enabled and all that it's pretty sim it's a pretty simple process for you guys and um I recommend that you guys um just use this way. Now there are other ways to do this. There are other ways such as using file Zilla which is right here. It's a it's a simpler way to upload your plugins. dot com. Then you want to just type in James, your new your username, which could be found on which could be found on your FTP file access right here. If your FTP username, you need to copy that and go into FileZilla and paste it right there. Then you want to type in your password to your Multicraft. Then you click Quick Connect. If it does not work, you want to retype your password. And maybe you're on that. Oh, wait. If it doesn't work, make sure you type in this name right. You want to copy that and go over here. Seems like my caps lock is on. And I did not put the three. So now we'll just do my password and quick connect. Hmm. Once there, if it says this, then you got to put
Hmm. Oh, get rid of the HTTP if you have that. And no port. Then click connect. You should be uploaded to your world if you guys can see. Plugin can be found right here with the jar file. This is a simple, this is a more simpler way if you would like to download FileZilla. It will be in the description for a download, and it is much simpler than doing it the manual way. All you have to do in here is make sure on here you turn off your server. And for the sake of this video, I'm just going to delete all the plugins here for the sake of the video. Delete. Once that's deleted, you want to exit out and go back in. It should have empty direct listing if you only deleted one if you only had one plugin and deleted it. Now what you want to do is just drag all this into there. As you can see, just to upload plugins, this is much simpler to use and everything is back in order. Now what you want to do is just start the server once again and go into your Minecraft and log in and just join your server and you should be able to join. For the sake of this video, I will show you that it works and if you guys have any questions please comment down below and um if you guys like this then please subscribe to me and you will get more multicraft videos and I'll just help you guys with anything that you need on here now going into full screen I will show you that it works there and there it was set up a simpler way and worked the same way slash slash still works and everything still works with this I hope this guy's helped you and please like it if it did and please tell me what the problem is and what it says in the console if you have any problems with anything make sure you upload anything like something like a zip file in the unpack section and put it in the upload the other side if it's just a dot jar file now I will show you what a jar, dot jar file looks like if you guys would get this something called essentials helps you with a lot of stuff with minecraft on the server. It would help you do multiple things and just do a lot for you. As you see these are only .jar files. So what you want to do then, if you want to upload all of them, you would of course put them in the unpack. If you only want to upload one, you would go into here, files, FTP access, and put in your password. And then go into plugins and upload, and then files to upload. What you would do then is you can either drag it like so, or some browsers don't do anything when dragging. Then what you want to do, whatever essentials you want, is you just put it up here, put it somewhere. And you go back here, choose file, and essentials.jar. This is one of those plugins where you don't need anything. You don't need to stop the server. Some plugins you do need to stop the server. And it's safe to it would be safer to stop the server. For the sake, I'm going to show you the way of not stopping it. What you want to do is slash reload. When you do slash reload, it should say that. And then when you do plugins, 
it should have essentials. When you do help, there should be a lot more commands, such as AFK, back, slash back, slash back up, slash balance, and that is basically a money key right there. So far I have zero dollars, and yeah, but I'm pretty sure I can buy anything because I am op. If you guys have any questions about any plugins, I could do a plugin review for you guys, if you guys would like, and um, I'll just help you. If you guys have any questions, please put them in the comments below, and if you guys need any help anywhere, just, like I said before, put it in the comments or send me a private message. If you guys like this video, and more Minecraft, Multicraft videos, then please subscribe, and um, if you guys like the video, please like it. And um, if you guys know friends on here, and they want to know how to upload plugins, just favorite the button, and or pu press the favorite button, and you will help them too. Thank you for watching this video, and I hope it helped you, and this was Multicraft, how to upload plugins, and... Bye.